Hi guys, Patrick here from Engineering Shock Electronics and ElectronicLessons.com. Uh, EngineeringShock.com is down, but uh, we're rebuilding it. Should be back up in about two weeks. Anyway, uh, <clears throat> I made a video yesterday of me using this beastly transformer to charge a 400 farad supercapacitor. So what I'm doing today is I'm putting two 2600 farad capacitors in series, and I'm going to charge it to just under five volts. Uh, and so we're essentially got a, we've got a series bank of a max charge of five volts at 1300 farads. So this would take a, this is going to take a long time to charge. But what I've got here is my uh, beastly transformer, and uh, one of the outputs AC is uh, six volts. And I've got a huge rectifier, which I'm actually going to stop the video, and I'm going to give you a close up of it right now. I've got eight diodes in my bridge. Uh, two sets or four sets of two in parallel and uh, just a smoothing capacitor which isn't really needed because we're going to be uh, placing it on a capacitor bank anyway but this is how I built it also got a tiny tiny decoupler in there it should output six volts at about three amps but I'm thinking it'll actually be outputting a heck of a lot more than that anyway this is probably isn't the safest project I've ever done uh, I've got a uh, the transformer has many outputs including a four hundred uh, a 400 volt AC, 200 milliamp output, which is taped off, so I won't electrocute myself. Uh, but I'm expecting that this will charge pretty darn fast. Uh, so let's just plug it in. Okay, I'm just about to plug my transformer in. Got my safety glasses. I'm not going to keep it plugged in for long. This is essentially just want to see how the the charge rate of these two capacitors in series. Ah. Uh. Wow, that's pretty darn fast. I'm expecting actually to see some of the uh, the uh, diodes to start. Oh yeah, there we go. Some of the solder starting to melt. <clears throat> so, oh yeah. So I'm actually going to let's just. Not sure if you can see any of the smoke coming off that but there's some solder starting to uh... there's some so solder is starting to melt on here so I'm gonna have to reinforce that with some thicker gauge wire but we just charged a 13 farad supercapacitor bank to a volt in no time flat Hell, um... let's charge it to two volts if, if the, the uh... if the, di if the solder on the diodes start melting that's fine I'll just resolder it I'm actually gonna watch it so let's just try it again wow that's charging really fast unbelievable this is a ton of power ton of power um, I can charge that up to five volts and I'm just watching the oh starting to smoke again so now I'm going to stop it. Ah, shit! Ha 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 ha! Shit! Oh, my rectifier fell to pieces. That's what I get. Whoo! Ah. Well. I'm glad you guys got to be here for that. It's, uh, I actually didn't see it happen. I was trying to unplug the transformer. But, <laughs> oh, jeez. Well, we know that I, I know that I can safely charge the supercapacitors, but the uh, that rectifier was not meant for this world. It literally fell to pieces. Anyway, um, thanks for watching, everyone. <laughs> Hope you enjoyed this blooper video. Um, it smells like, it smells like burning in here.